So here in the city of Santa Clarita in the month of May, we have a lot of bike events going on. Uh, the Amgen Tour of California is coming to town, and one of the bicycle events that we have uh, year after year is our Bike to Work Day. And here to talk to us about that is Laura Jardine from the city's Environmental Services Division. Uh, Laura, talk about Bike to Work Day. Yes, um, this will actually be the 10th annual Santa Clarita Bike to Work Day Challenge. So uh, we're looking to increase participation again like we have the last couple years. It'll be on Thursday, May 16th. And um, last year we had 26 businesses participate with a total of 247 bicyclists that day. So we're hoping to get those numbers bumped up a little bit this year and make another really fun event out of it. Okay, so Bike to Work Day is a business-focused event. So this is where uh, different businesses around town compete to see uh, how many riders they can get uh, riding in and, or taking the bus in. Yep, exactly. They can um, put their bike on the bus like you just mentioned and then bike in the rest of the way. That does count. And it is a business competition, so the businesses usually try to rally as many employees as they can to see who can win. We have three categories, small business, medium business, and large business. And um, they're eligible for prizes as a business, but also um, the individuals are uh, eligible for a raffle prize as well. Okay, and so talk about how this works. So people just leave their homes and then they bike to wherever they're going to go, but there are pit stops along the way. Correct. Um, this year we'll actually have five. We've had four in the past few years, but we'll, we'll add an additional one this year over in the Industrial Center um, off of Avenue Stanford. So that'll be a fifth opportunity for people to stop in, get a refreshment, get some biking information, maybe some giveaway items. We give away uh, tire patch kits. We'll have also bike pumps, uh, tire pumps at the pit stops in case you have a little accident along the way. Um, but it's a, a really great way to get the camaraderie going. People get to stop and visit with each other and figure out where everyone's going that day and get to have like a snack and energize yourself the rest of the way. And I think the city of Santa Clarita is the defending champion for the large organizations. Who are some of the organizations that participate year in, year out? Um, we have the LA County Sheriff Station, we have Kaiser Permanente, we have Henry Mayo, we have College of the Canyons, those are some of the larger businesses. Uh, Marzocchi USA has won for small business for a couple years now. Um, there's a lot of you know smaller businesses that have maybe only five or six employees, but they still get as many as they can to participate, as well as the 500 employees. So it's a real broad range of uh, businesses that participate. So Laura, for businesses that are interested in joining Bike to Work Day, uh, what what do they do and when are the cut cutoffs for re registration? Um, there really isn't a cutoff. I mean, you have up until the day before, which would be May 15th, to let me know that you'd like to participate. It's good to get your information in early. That way I can help you promote the event by providing flyers or posters. But um, basically, you'll just contact me or go to greensantaclarita.com and it'll provide all the information that you need there to be able to um, get your business registered, whether you've, re you've participated in the past or if you're a brand new business that's never participated, we can get it set up in a matter of just a minute or two. Okay, Laura, I want to thank you for joining us. Uh, if you're out there, you got a business looking to participate in this year's Bike to Work Day. It is Thursday, May 16th. For more information, you can go to greensantaclarita.com.